Hi, I'm Gary, and if you clicked on the thumbnail thinking that I was the six-pack guy, uh, not right now, 25 years ago, but right now I'm the other guy, which is pretty crazy how one person can yo-yo so much in a lifetime, but to be honest, I was a fat kid. I lost a lot of weight in my teenage years, and then in my 30s and 40s, it all came back, and like most people, I'm now heavy, heavier than I want to be, um, but I think I can change that. I think that with one small step a day, I can lose 40 pounds in my 40s, hence the title. And I think I could help people along the way. I'm going to post 10 minute videos, very simple, what I do in a day to get to my goal. I'm going to post some recipes that I use, a couple of different workouts, nothing extreme, a lot of walking, a lot of riding a bike, all very simple stuff. I'm not 22 anymore, I'm in my 40s. So hopefully I can help someone else with the same exact goal that I have. And I hope you guys join me. All right, day one weigh-in test. So first things first, I am wearing clothes. That's because as you can see, the scale is reflective. I do not want to get kicked off YouTube with my first video. Two, it doesn't actually matter that I'm wearing clothes because I'm just going to weigh myself every day in clothes. So I'll still see the progress and it won't matter. So here we go. Dum, dum, dum. 221.6 and I killed the scale well okay only progress to be made then so Let's we're at go. the grocery store this morning and we're going to work on the first meal of the day breakfast and all we're going to do is we're going to try to lower our calories while still eating delicious food and having it fill us up and we're going to grab something called Ezekiel bread uh, it's in the frozen department it comes in many different flavors I personally like the sweeter breakfast just something to get you going in the morning so i grabbed the cinnamon raisin uh you're gonna put it in a toaster it's gonna be just like any other breakfast waffle or pancake that you toast for your kids uh the difference here is it's gonna be zero grams of sugar on the label uh it is gonna be low glycemic so it's not gonna spike your insulin basically it's just a food that tastes like anything else but much lower calories so let's go grab that so in the organic section we have the ezekiel bread which comes in sprouted of sodium and the best one by far would be the raisin and if you look right here we're looking at 80 calories zero added sugar so this is what ezekiel bread looks like especially the cinnamon raisin one as you can see full of raisins looks just like cinnamon raisin bread without the kids pepperidge farm swirls so all we're going to do is we're going to toast that and I'll show you what it looks like. All right, so while we're, while we're cooking our Ezekiel bread, I'm gonna talk to you guys and I'm gonna make my egg whites. And yes, I understand there is a yellow part in here, which is clearly not an egg white. So this is kind of up to you. It's, it's a preference thing. One egg yolk has 55 calories, okay? And I am trying to stir with my left hand while holding the phone. So the 55 calories are up to you. It all depends on how you feel you're doing with your progress, how fast you want to lose weight, how strict you want to be. It really is up to the person. What I do find silly is using four or five whole eggs, especially if you're making them scrambled. Because the reality is if you, as you can see here, I use three eggs, right? So one egg is full and two are white. As you can see, the scrambled eggs look perfectly yellow. I probably should turn the heat down. So again, you know, 55 calories, you're already eating egg whites as it is. The rest is kind of up to you. You want to cut it, cut it, just make egg whites. You don't throw one full egg in there. And as you can see, you know, they look kind of yellow. So that works. And here's our breakfast. You got two slices of raisin Ezekiel bread and three egg whites with one whole egg. Well, two egg whites and one whole egg. The three egg whites with the whole egg total about 100 calories. You got 55 in the egg yolk, 50 in the three egg whites. The Ezekiel bread's 80 calories each. This entire breakfast is 250 calories. Just logically, you know, we'll get into this later in the posts and later in my videos, but you can always add a turkey bacon slice, a bacon slice, whatever, because here you're looking at 250 calories. I mean, if you're doing a 1500 calorie, 2000 calorie diet, a full meal of 250 calories leaves you 80, 90% of your daily allowance still available. So this is just today, it's this first start and we're gonna go from here. All right, so we're doing our 
first exercise of the day. We're gonna try to do 20 to 30 minutes of walking a day. Um, I'm gonna upload the screenshot of the fitness tracker. I have an Apple Watch. Um, so it shows me the steps and all that. I'm sure you guys have Fitbits or whatever you know you use just to get the steps in. I know it sounds kind of cliche or corny, but like you're trying to do 10,000 steps. I, I, I know, it is what it is. You can't do it, you can't do it. You can do more, always great. Um, trying to keep this video under 10 minutes. So I appreciate you guys kind of, you know, hanging out. Uh, if you like it, stick around. Uh, tomorrow or the next day, I'm gonna try to do another recipe. I'll show you guys some cool things with labels where you can eat the exact same food, exact same serving, everything the same. Just change the brand and save yourself 20, 30, 50, 100 calories. It's pretty crazy. I don't know why more people don't talk about it. Um, anything else, you know, it's, I'm not very tech savvy, so I'm still learning as I go. So I know the sound is probably awful in a lot of these um, clips, but the fat will come off uh, and, you know, it'll be a daily journey, step by step. Appreciate you guys hanging out. Uh, I'd say subscribe, but there's nothing here right now, but obviously appreciate it because I'll keep posting and you guys can follow me on my journey and definitely comment. Let me know what you're trying to accomplish and maybe I can help or maybe we could all do it together. See you guys tomorrow.